I do disagree with a lot of people here in Washington and maybe some supporters of Trump who say that this is an effort of the Obama administration to undermine the Trump administration, the carryovers. Mm -hmm. I'm worried it's something deeper than that. I'm concerned that it's an effort on those who want a provocation with Russia or other countries to, to sort of push the president in a direction. So I don't think it's Trump versus Obama. I think it's really the deep state versus the president, the duly elected president. And that concerns me. You, I think, you think it's a concerted effort to try to provoke, to provoke Russia? Look, I think Obama was just as much a victim of this as Trump is now. We, Obama didn't come into office wanting to overthrow governments, but he overthrew Libya, he assisted in overthrowing Assad, and we were involved in the overthrow in the Ukraine. We're still occupying the Middle East. These were not initiatives that Obama had when he was elected, but I think he got pulled by the military industrial complex and the intelligence community into these positions. He even helped cover up Saudi okay. Arabia's involvement in 9-11. Okay, that's a, 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 an important point that we'll definitely want to discuss more if you have evidence that this is a concerted effort to draw the president into a conflict with Russia. I do want to have you back on, Congress, when we're out of time now. Thank Thanks, you very Kate. much.